hi guys welcome back again with a new video in this video here i will show you how we can enable this 3d home screen effect on any of the iphone especially on iphones that are currently running on s15.7.2 so as you can see in this video i'm using here the iphone 7 so this is the software version 15.7.2 so if i also using this software version on iphone in this video i will show you how we can get this 3d home screen effect on that iphone so make sure you follow the complete steps in this video so that you can easily set up this 3d home screen and enjoy this 3d effect on your iphone so let's get started how we can enable this 3d effect so firstly i will leave a link in the description so go and open that particular link so after that you can see there's a shortcut home screen creator so just tap on this get shortcut option and it will automatically opens in your shortcuts app so i have already enabled this shortcuts in your shortcuts application so as you can see when i tap on this add shortcut you will see there's an option of the replace so i am all already having this shortcut in my shortcuts app so firstly go and add this shortcut so now adding the shortcut you can see this one is a shortcut available in this application so now we just need to carefully watch the full process here so now just tap on this shortcut when you tap on the shortcut you will see there's an option of the yes add elements so firstly tap on this elements option and now we just need to select here the shadow depth effect so we just need to go back right here and you will see there's a folder available in this files application the folder name is hsc so just tap on this option and click on this zip option and this zip will automatically extract to this folder this one is a contact folder so tap on this folder and you will see there are option of the docs icons and layout and widgets so we just need to tap on this icons option so we just need to now select here the shadow depth effect this one is a shadow depth effect just tap on this one folder and you will see there's the option of the all block one block two so we just need to select here the block all option this one is the first one all option to so just tap on this one and now click on this done option and now we just need to wait here and here's the option of the yes or no save layout so we just need to click on this no save layout option and now click on this done option and here click on this ok and now guys click on this done option and here we just need to choose the wallpaper for the iphone just tap on this ok option and now guys we just need to select here that particular wallpaper so i select here this wallpaper for my iphone 3d effect just tap on the wallpaper which you like so i like this one and now just tap on this no option in the bottom side and you will see there's a done option just tap on this done option and now click on the done option again and this one is a shadow depth effect and you can easily save as a photo in your photos application to set this as a wallpaper so now click on this set wallpaper where you can easily save this photo in a photos app so now click on this set wallpaper and now you are ready to use this 3d shadow effect on your iphone home screen so now as you can see this is now ready go to the iphone home screen and you will see this one is the 3d depth effect for the iphone so i hope you guys find this method helpful please give a like and also share this video with your friends so guys they can also enable this 3d depth effect on the iphone home screen so i will see you in the next video so guys thanks for watching